Phila, you should like totally do like fitness and like nutrition topics like monthly. Kinda like a newsletter? Oh hi, my name is Philip, and I'm a personal trainer and group exercise instructor and I welcome you to Pale Exercise where we don't push products, sell buys, or rant. We give you education and facts because facts are powerful. Fitness News is a monthly series that will cover four fitness and nutrition topics that I believe can affect your life in one way or another. Four topics in under five minutes. Timer up, let's go. The Food and Drug Administration is planning on cracking down on plant-based milk, such as rice, coconut, almond, and soy milks. The FDA definition of milk is being from an animal-based product. Yet, it hasn't been enforcing it and the National Dairy Milk Producers Federation wants the FDA to label plant-based milk as imitators and no longer be called milk. In defense, the Good Food Institute, which defends plant-based foods, said no one is buying almond or soy milk thinking it comes from a cow. Why? Follow the money. Wisconsin is the number two state on dairy production, lost 500 dairy farmers in 2017, and plant-based milk sales are continually improving year after year. They're not cow turds. No, much smaller scale. Ew. Next, are your exercise classes hurting your hearing? Nope. Mm -mm. The CDC says that any noise at or above 85 decibels can damage your hearing. While one should limit sounds above 100 decibels for less than 15 minutes. This study went into many different spin studios and found that the average decibel limit for spin class was 113 decibels. Just a reminder, 15 minutes at 100 decibels can damage your hearing. One in four Americans complain of hearing loss. Also, hearing loss may increase cognitive problems and increase the chances of dementia. What should we do? You can get an app on your phone to track your class levels and I encourage you to approach the instructor if they're too high. Instructors, I encourage you to test your levels as you're putting yourself at risk and your participants at risk. Also, if your boss says your levels are too low, I would show them the government facts and that they're putting you at unsafe levels, which makes unsafe working conditions. What was that? Recently, a large alcohol study came out and said that no alcohol is safe for consumption. This study looked at effects of alcohol from 195 countries from 1992 to 2016. Alcohol was the seventh leading risk factor for premature death in 2016. The authors did note that moderate drinking may protect against heart disease, yet risk of cancer and other diseases outweigh the risk. An estimated 88,000 people die from alcohol-related causes annually in the U.S., making alcohol the third leading cause of preventable death behind tobacco and poor diet and physical inactivity. Preventable means it can be stopped. In 2014, 31% of driving fatalities were linked to alcohol. Drug overdoses killed more than 72,000 Americans in 2017. Oh, that's ironic that the media places so much emphasis on opiates, yet alcohol deaths are higher and tend to be high each year. Hmm, that's interesting. Health-wise, from cancers of the breast, mouth, throat, esophagus, liver, colon, it is high in calories at seven calories a gram, has no nutritional benefits. A 2014 Gallup poll showed one in three Americans say drinking alcohol has been a cause to family problems. According to the CDC, individuals who do not drink, they recommend not starting drinking at all. Don't even think about it. And if you do drink, moderation is key. Next, baby carrots. Oh my gosh, I know how baby carrots are made. They're when a mama carrot and a data carrot love each other very, very much. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> baby carrots are not baby carrots. They're just bigger carrots cut into smaller, cuter sizes. I am your father. No! So. <laughs> it has been said that baby carrots are rinsed in chlorine. Is that true? Ew. Pool water. Yes, pooling. Pooling. Chlorine is in pools. Yes, chlorine is in pools. Why? 
to prevent foodborne illnesses, this amount of chlorine is within the safe limits set by the FDA that is allowed to be found in tap water. Do know that people who drank water with chlorine were 93% more likely to get cancer. Only 93%. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 93%. Lastly, fun fact for you, you can eat too many carrots and cause your skin to turn orange. Let's do it. That's it. Woo, look at that time, we're on time. Boom, first episode and we're on time. When is that gonna happen again? Take a picture of that clock. Random September facts. September is the only month that has the same number of letters as it is the month of the year. Nine letters for the ninth month. Please check out my links below and look at all the research that put this video together. Each topic, I typically spent one to five hours researching. And lastly, September 19th is National Talk Like a Pirate Day, so let's give you a pirate joke. Why is pirating so addictive? It's not opiates, trust me. They say once y'all lose your hand, ye get hooked. <laughs> Pirates! They, like Captain Hook, like crocodiles. Wait, there's no crocodiles in the ocean. Thank you for watching. I hope you learned something new. Ciao. Oh, this is a good one. Why did the ocean... Oh, dang it. What did the ocean say to the pirate? Nothing. It just waved. Uh, I get that. Like waves. Yeah. I think that's what it means.